Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. My name is Amir Ajul Kamaruzi from Gucci Ikhwan, Australia, Sydney. Today, I'm going to be showing you how to cut lamb cutlets. And as you can see, this lamb is wrapped in plastic because to prevent it from drying out. This is so it keeps the lamb clean and also if it gets dried, the lamb can lose some of its weight. So to remove the plastic, we lift the top one up and the bottom one down. And here you can see this lamb weighs 15 kilos and on the right you have the halal sign. And now to separate the lamb into three different parts, you're going to mark and cut the legs and the forequarter. So after marking your lamb, proceed by cutting using a bandsaw or a handsaw. Here you have the forequarter. And now we are going to cut the legs. Here we have the middle of the lamb, which contains the loin and ribs. And now to separate the ribs from the loin, you are going to cut after the ninth rib. And repeat on the other side. So here you have the ribs and now you are going to remove the flaps but to do that you are going to mark both ends and you are going to cut across the marked line and cut the marked area with your pencil. So now from this bone you are going to cut right down against the bone. So now with the bandsaw, you are going to cut in an angle on both sides. And now you are going to remove the paddywhack or the nuchal ligament and the shoulder bone. And now you are going to mark both ends of the rack and cut in a straight line from one end to the other. Next, scorch your knife against the bone to remove the fat and remove the sinew in between the bones. This whole piece is called a rack of lamb. You could leave it as it is, but today I'm showing you how to cut it into cutlets. So now, what you want to do is gently cut in between the bones. And finally we have our lamb cutlets. Thank you for watching. And with the barakah of Rasulullah and his beloved ones, we are able to share with you the right skills and techniques that Allah has taught us. Not only can we present our meat in a beautiful manner, but from a clean and halal source, we know a pure heart is formed.